welcome back to a reality channel you guys um it is wonderful to be back on my youtube actually enjoying real life to be honest um, my birthday was back in november and i wanted to actually share my birthday vlog with you guys we went up to broken bow oklahoma and it was up in the mountains so that's what you guys seen in the previous clip but as far as now me and justin couldn't get the audio going because we were talking about other things but other than that we did have to go grocery shopping before we went up the mountain so that was super fun um here is me being super silly licking the bottom of my shoe i mean i really got that from one of my cousins i ain't gonna say no name but they are super sneaker heads and i'm very much so not so when i first when i got my all icy whites i got super excited and i licked it it's okay though dirt don't hurt but as y'all can see the cabin is super super nice i mean we went on a tiny house experience which is a small cottage and it was so comfortable and nice it had it set up for the holidays in which that's what turned me on the most but as you all see i did get a new vlogging materials and i'm super excited to be back on youtube um for dinner we actually had some steak and chicken tacos that was the basic thing that we did but we both love tacos so it wasn't much, you know, for us to just go ahead and whip it up a little bit. But other than that, they provided everything as far as pots and pans, utensils, cups, like even s'mores material. Um, and we did go with, of course, the Larazin Uncle beans, rice. If you don't know about that rice, you pop it in the microwave and you are good, honey. We talking about good. Y'all, that, that meal was so good and we were so tired from driving. But it was like a three hour drive as you all see yes that was the heated jacuzzi and it was nice now y'all when we woke up the next morning it was lit i was so happy to see that because again we did get there when it was dark and I, that that really did make me feel so grateful for life um but other than that you guys enjoy the vlog i am so, I am so grateful to just simply be alive and to be living and my all of my manifestations um i very much so have always been a nature girl as you all saw in other vlogs but when it come down to this view in general it's more so it's it's the life behind it guys very much so the life um my boyfriend understands it i love that he love on me for it but one of my little cousins um, she actually sent me, which is Brianna. Hey, Bree, if you watching this, um, she actually sent me a text message and it said she was going to say, I'm, you know, I, I'm officially grown, grown since I'm turning 27. But she was like, you know, many more of just many more years of just growing in general. So a lot of you guys, everyone, actually, every single person message has touched me this morning and it's only like nine o'clock. So. The fact that I have the sun on my face and my skin is just flowing. Like, y'all, I'm so grateful. I'm just super grateful to be alive. And I can't wait to get cute later. Hopefully, when we go to the casino, you know, we hit us some, get some luck. Y'all send me some luck. But other than that, we were about to go canoeing or kayaking, ziplining, or ATVing. So, we don't know if some of those things are open because it's super cold out here or it's cold but it's not too too cold but it's like freaking 37 degrees so that is cool but i love the way i love cold so um you guys are actually be following us today so let me go in here and check on breakfast because i hope i'm not you know burning nothing up with them so we'll be back so i got a question who all cook their eggs in a pan like this or a pot like this so it can turn out like that y'all let me know let me know who do that because we do that over here i like my like i like a circle mcdonald's do it i know a lot of places that do it like that you know a lot of people like the traditional pan or whatever but we like to be different over here so y'all let me know in the comments who likes to do that because we do yes y'all i had to come out and start a fire um because it goes with the aesthetic of the view. And I had to start it. Um, I had a really great birthday. 
so far. So this is something that I couldn't wait to do is actually like start the fire. But we'll actually be doing marshmallows and stuff today. So I'm just giving you guys a different view in which our small little cottage right there. Say hello. Love it. Babe said, listen, uh, as far as a tiny house, no, we're going to get a cottage. But so far, I love it. That right there is the hammock. I finally like put that up. But other than that, look at this beauty. It's the views, y'all. Thank goodness for 27. Whoop. But other than that, we're about to cook and I'm actually take y'all along with me but we got the fire going all right y'all so as y'all can see this here is actually uh my new vlog holder yes we are upgrading honey but let me find out how to get it out the way i'm sorry y'all all righty so anyway totally fine we are actually s'more um making s'mores and just get the heat let me see the inside babe let me see the inside let them see the inside, see the inside. yeah <laughs> <laughs> anyways um as you all can see yes i have the marshmallows first of course um but yes I'm trying to make sure that, you know, we don't want too much of a fire, but babe, can you put some more on it? Because we're just going to be out here for a long, um, just a short period of time. So that's why you guys see the whole ash of it. Because we don't have a lot of wood due to us not, you know. Mm. There we go. Okay. Now I'm good. I'm going to put it in a fire for a little bit before it goes down since we just you know yes so i'm gonna come back when we actually have our grand cracker a graham cracker and our chocolate oh it's already melting all righty y'all so we're about to actually do s'mores um no we're not saying you gotta stick it over justin like stop I'm gonna put music over this anyway. Cause we just be capping. Capping and talking noise. Y'all, so one thing he likes to do is mess with me when I'm vlogging. I'm I be trying to be professional here. and, you know, get us out the hood and shit. But y'all, y'all okay. think he quiet, but he a slick talking ass nigga. That's what he all right, is. Alright, y'all. So, all right, y'all. So, <laughs> as you all in the other video, um, we did get the Airhead Gingerbread House Kit, in which we wanted to match the aesthetic, of course, of the actual tree that we have in the cottage, um, which is a tiny house experience. But we wanted to try and, you know, do this. But I will say, they really hold us on the Airheads. Like I said again, this is a reality TV. But y'all, look at this. Look at this shit. Look, look. Look what they gave us. Man, they didn't give us enough. He's talking crazy. about being grateful. He's Thanks, talking about being grateful. Thanksgiving just passed. Really? I'm just saying, it really did. It did. You didn't learn nothing, obviously. Yes, yeah, yes, you did. I'm Okay, y'all see what I be talking about? He oh that boy, he can sell a rock. He real good at selling and marketing. I mean my man is a boss, but when it come down to his slick talking, he know I am the most grateful person on this earth. I am a giver. I refuse to receive from anybody. I mean, I'm not sure if that's a good and bad thing, grateful. but I'm finding Very a balance. Very so grateful, but when you're building an actual gingerbread house, it's like, look at the aesthetic of the actual house. So I'm hoping that, you know, these are actually big enough for having these. This is just a little amount. So we're about to, we're about to get going. Stop. What I tell y'all, he's so slick. Like, y'all hear him in the background talking about some, come on. Like, he's not an impatient person. He's truly adorable when it comes to his patience. But, oh, my God, y'all know everybody got flaws. And this man, listen, this the person that's going to keep me up to date and on my shit. Because the way I be moving, I do move in slow motion. But that's only when I'm drinking. But in real life, we are bosses. But 
when it came down to the gingerbread man i truly recommend um for family friends friends giving uh friend christmases and all that like super dope for families and all like i truly enjoyed this activity and it was my first time building a gingerbread house in general so many times i went to the market saw it never got it which was super crazy but something i also wanted to mention was in broken bow they actually have one walmart and they do not sell meats you have to actually go to the next local grocery store to get meats so it was kind of shocking that we went into walmart and we was like where is your frozen you know meats dinners oh we don't have it here so that was super <laughs> some informative information that we did know about broken bow super small um inconvenient but they do not sell meats at walmart crazy huh <laughs> all righty so before the vlog end we did pack up and we're actually headed out we did not get too many memories of our trip because he really wanted it to be very conservative and to ourselves but we did get um great footage of the vlog and our experience but what you guys are looking at now is something that i could not wait to share with my a reality family man like this is crazy how the actual owner of the cottage he has a journal and it the cottage opened up in 2020 in which anyone that experienced the college can, cottage can write down their feelings how they felt about it but of course me i took a picture of the view and i left it and it was on my birthday so trippity that with that little texas made sure i was ripping but other than that i'll see you guys in the next vlog thank y'all for watching